Okay, for the medical students, um, there there are many opportunities. If you have good marks applying in Tehran Medical Sciences University, you don't need an entry exam. You even don't need the entry exam scores like um, we in NWFP. Khabar Pakhtunkhwa, we have uh, uh, ETA test that has been taken for a long period of time. Uh, whether you are eligible for uh, taking an admission in uh, a medical university, but in Iran you don't need that. If you are a foreigner, I mean you are non-Iranian, you don't need entry test and entry test exams. The only things, um, uh, only thing that you are gonna need is the your scores and your metric certificate, your college certificate. There's just two certificates. First is the metric certificate. The second one is the uh, FSC certificate in medical, pre-medical, uh, the original certificates. Uh, one is the mark sheet that is called transcript, and one is the degree that you are going to get from your school, the original one. And then um, you are going to need good marks, you know, if entry test is not needed, but the good scores are really needed. So, okay, I'm going to tell you how you're going to apply for this. Um, you have to search there on University of Medical Sciences and then click on that. When you're going to open the official website of the uh, DOMS, there on University of Medical Sciences, you're gonna uh, click on uh, the button, the blue button, apply now. Okay, I'm gonna click that. Here you go. Okay, I'm gonna wait for the page to load. Here we have apply now. Okay, and the programs that you are going to take admission in. So I'm gonna tell you there are undergraduate majors, undergraduate uh, graduate majors, other programs, fee structure, financial aid, a lot of things. So I'm gonna click apply now. There you go. When you click on apply now, you are going to make an account on the university website. For example, I have already registered my name on the university, so I have all this info in here. But you have to create account, okay? I have to log in because I already have an account. But you, because you don't have, you have to click on another option that is create an account. Here you're going to click and create an account. Here you're going to need the first name, uh, your second name or last name or family name or surname, whatever. After that, you are going to provide your WhatsApp or Telegram number, um, country code, and whatever. After that, email address and your password. Here, you're going to, in this way, you are going to uh, create your um, uh, account on the official university page. After that, when you have made uh, the uh, form, uh, you can apply through that. So, I'm going to tell you about the undergraduate measures. Undergraduate uh, programs are here, uh, listed here. Um, there are a lot of them. Uh, for example, the first one is MD, MBBS, um, Master of Phar uh, Pharmacy, PharmD, DDS, BDS, um, and other AS, AS Associate of Science, BSc in uh, like midwifery, uh, physiotherapy, and uh, hygiene technician. Anesthesia, nursing, so uh, there are a lot of uh, fields that you can apply. Okay. There are some requirements. There are something that you have to, uh, you know, provide. Um, these are, uh, I'm going to click on undergraduate admission requirements so that um, you can see what are you going to need to apply. Okay. Undergraduate requirements. Okay, scroll down. So here are some of the requirements. You're gonna a letter of application or motivation. Why you are applying in the Tehran University? You have to provide the motivation. What is your motivation? A resume or CV, um, high school certificate, college certificate, uh, showing a transcript and numbers. Your scores in biology, chemistry, mathematics, and physics, along with complete transcript of results all the numbers and scores. IELTS is also needed, but if your English is good, it's not needed because you have learned everything because you're Pakistani or 
a country if you're a native speaker english speaker you don't need ielts and if you are uh, you have uh, completed your studies in pakistan because pakistan in pakistan we have english everywhere so we learn everything in english so we do don't need ielts okay so uh, how you're going to apply you are going to make an account uh if you click on apply now okay it, it is going to take a lot of time so if you click on apply now a tab will open a page will open where you are going to create an account i told you this before after that you're going to provide your first name and your last name after that you are pro going to provide your whatsapp number or telegram number and then you're going to make an account and through that account you're going to uh fill an application form okay tell let me tell you the finance and uh, tell me up uh, let, let me tell you about the fee structure fee is about one thousand five hundred dollars per semester to three thousand dollars per semester it depends from what country you are and um, uh, what degree you are applying for for example for doctorate degree there is more money to pay like three thousand dollars per semester for bachelor and master degree it is one thousand eight hundred dollars per semester uh, but it varies it varies and it depends so if you're gonna need this scholarship okay if you're gonna need this scholarship uh, you have to mention it mention it in your form like in your form you will be given 